artistic director Wen Wai Wong will be personally putting a pair of exclamation marks on Ballet Edmonton's 2022-23 season, with two of his creations being presented at this weekend's season finale, which is known as Consensus. It's taking place May 5th and 6th at McEwen University's Trifo Theatre in Edmonton. And to talk about Le Loup de La Fontaine and also the piece Le Quattro, I'm thrilled to say that the great Wen Wai Wong is here to speak to us right now all about this terrific season capper. It is such a thrill to have you back here. Wen Wai Wong, thank you and welcome back to CKUA Airwaves. Oh, thank you for letting me here. Yeah. So let me start off by asking you, how does it feel to be capping off this season? It's been, as usual, a season of innovation and adventure where Ballet Edmonton is concerned. Oh, this season is really, really busy for us uh, in that we had our first national tour across Canada, six cities, and we're just come back from Vernon. It's our last city on this tour. And then and now we're in a studio rehearsal, our final show for Edmonton audience. Yes, I'm thrilled you've taken some time. You're actually right in the studio right now getting set for this one. Uh, consensus is, well, first off, let me ask you a little bit about the title because this is two pieces, but the title of the show itself is interesting. It's like the word consent and the word consensus kind of mashed together. What's the significance of that one for you? It, it is about the music because this program actually is basically commissioned by uh, Victoria Symphony and Dance Victoria invite us to collaboration with these two organizations in Victoria, BC. And actually we're just premiered these two pieces at Victoria in the Royal Theater. And they are really completely different music. The, you know, the quattro is coming from Vovotis Four Seasons, but remixed by uh, Max Richter in the new way to listen the classic music, powerful, dynamic, beautiful, beautiful. So excited to dance on. Our second piece is La Lude de la Fontaine. It is a story-based a piece and the composer is from Toronto, Ian Cusa. And the music is epic and powerful and emotion. And somehow it's dark too because it's related to the story. I don't know, audience, want to know the story or do you want me to tell the story? I, I was going to ask you because I've heard a little bit about the, I mean, this is kind of a Canadian folk fable almost, right? That this is based on? Yeah, you know, it, it's part history, it's part legend. Mm. So it's in the Ontario, in that small town, two sized people from different culture background, they're always fighting and uh, they don't get along until the outsider, until the wolf comes, they united. <laughs> and they start fighting to the wolf rather than fighting with themselves. Mm. Of course, the end, they kill the wolf. And uh, of course, you know, that's the human tragedy. You know, we had to kill somebody to able to unite or mm. agree to something. Mm, that's I think it's really, really important story to tell even two days in our life. Yeah. So you have an opportunity to kind of weave this yarn with an important moral center to it as a, as a, as a dance storyteller, if you were, if you will. And then you also have the opportunity to share this absolutely incredible music of Vivaldi via Max Richter. And we'll hear a little bit of a taste of that coming up before too long. In fact, we had a, a CKUA fundraiser donor request the music of of Max Richter, so we're going to send that out to them. Uh, you get to have that as your backdrop for this. Uh, and what what a fitting way to cap off an amazing season for Ballet Edmonton. It's kind of a trip through all four seasons, I guess you must you might say that that that's a pretty exciting opportunity. Yeah, you know, like she says, it's like life from spring begins to the winter to the end, a new life begins again. And you know, it's our life. Our life, of course, spend much more longer than just for she says but then you think about you you youth to your you know childhood to your youth to your grow up and to getting older and and, and i think you can relate it with this for she says too yeah 
Well, here at CKUA, we just finished uh, the Rite of Spring that is our spring fundraiser. And of course, all of a sudden, the weather is really agreeing that it is spring. And I'm, I'm excited that you are all springing into this uh, amazing season ender with these two pieces, La Lou de La Fontaine and Le Quattro, as part of Consensus, the season finale coming up uh, May 5th and 6th. Ballet Edmonton presents it at Trifo Theatre in Edmonton at McEwen University. Uh, Wen Wai Wong, it is always such a thrill to get a chance to catch up with you. And congratulations to you and everybody at Ballet Edmonton on this splendid and oh-so-accomplished year. I can't wait to see where you take us next season for 23-24. Thank you so much. And now back to rehearsals with you, I guess. Yes, I have to continue work. <laughs> no, no break. Yeah. <laughs> we'll catch up with you soon. And here is the inspired music of Vivaldi via Max Richter. Find out all about the season-ending show Consensus this weekend by going to balletedmonton.ca.